despite the fact that the price of XRP Ripple has plummeted by a significant amount, there are several developments taking place in the background that indicate the beginning of a bull market. How are things going? In the near future, the SEC's legal proceeding against Ripple will be concluded. There are many who believe that the price of Ripple's XRP could shoot up by a staggering 60,000%. This is something that cannot be stopped. On the other hand, what type of argument are the experts making? Don't be concerned, this video contains all of the solutions. Let me explain this further. Thank you very much. In the ongoing case involving Ripple XRP, which is still ongoing, um, in addition to the fact that the value of digital currencies is constantly shifting, it is not always simple to keep things in perspective. Recent occurrences have added an additional layer of mystery to the situation, which has caused members of the XRP community to feel both excited and confused. Let's investigate the most recent happenings and sort through the noise in order to get to the bottom of things. To begin, there was a great deal of discussion over a supposed settlement meeting that was scheduled to take place on April 16th. A great many of individuals believe that this may be a pivotal moment in the litigation that Ripple was involved in with the SEC. However, the idea became more problematic when Ashley Prosper made a significant adjustment to the plan. It was not the case that such a settlement meeting was going to take place contrary to what some individuals believed at the time. When people in the community were exposed to false information, they were filled with hope nevertheless. Their hopes were destroyed when they were confronted with the harsh climate of reality. On April 1st, there was an open event that held 500 million XRP, which is equivalent to approximately 300 million USD. This event got people even more interested in the concept. Nevertheless, it turned out less. It turned out that even this was an example of having incorrect expectations. Everyone understood the situation after it was made abundantly obvious that the unlock was not a component of a larger strategy. However, it was really a straightforward error in the release strategy. Even in the midst of all of this erroneous information and destroyed hopes, there is one question that continues to stick out. What does this imply with regard to the case? Despite the fact that there was no agreement reached on April 16th, I continue to believe that the conclusion is very near. How come? Because Ripple is resilient even when things are not going as planned. They are able to weather the storm of legal examination with their unwavering determination. This view is strengthened by the fact that the SEC has a long history of failures. Whether it be Ripple's planned steps to comply with regulations or the fact that the Second Circuit Court of Appeals rejected their claim of compensation for financial loss, uh, it would appear that the defendant's case is becoming more compelling. The simplest way to put it is what Rob Grant, who is the Vice President of Global Affairs at Ripple, has to say Ripple has already won. Nevertheless, what does this imply for those who already possess XRP? A court case is not the only thing that is taking place here. For the future of decentralized banking, there is a battle that is now taking place. This tale is full of unexpected turns and twists that have an impact not only on Ripple, but also on the entire cryptocurrency industry. If the outcome is favorable, it may result in the development of other novel concepts and their widespread application. A protracted court battle has the potential to inhibit forward movement. The conflict between Ripple and the SEC is intensifying, and the situation is becoming increasingly tense as it remains ongoing. The stakes continue to rise as the story progresses and the narrative continues to move forward while doing so. However, what truly piques my curiosity is the apparent state of panic that the SEC is in, as well as the smart response that Ripple is providing. Investors are on the edge of their seats, eagerly anticipating the outcome of this high stakes struggle and keeping their fingers crossed. We invite you to join us as we investigate the last ditch efforts of the Securities and Exchange Commission, where their suffering is transformed into our happiness. It is our guarantee that you will not want to miss a single second of this riveting narrative from beginning to end. When Ripple announced the establishment of a stablecoin, the company was in the midst of a legal problem with the Securities and Exchange Commission sect taking into consideration the legislative ambiguity that surrounds digital assets. This was a really cunning strategy. Ripple's ability to adapt to changing circumstances is demonstrated by this strategic move, which also demonstrates the company's dedication to innovation, even in the face of such challenges. However, Ripple is significant in a variety of other ways in addition to its legal battles. When it comes to standing up to overreaching government regulations, it has become a model that others in the cryptocurrency market may and should follow. It sends a clear message to the whole cryptocurrency world that the corporation will not withdraw from its position in response to the allegations made by the SEC. Retaliating is not a waste of time or effort. A significant number of the issues that Ripple is facing are also being experienced by Coinbase, which is another prominent cryptocurrency company that is engaged in a legal battle with the SEC. The regulatory authorities are paying a great deal of attention to both of these companies face allegations that they violated laws governing securities. However, they are both resolute in their commitment to challenge the charges made by the SEC and to defend their own perspectives in court. While the ripple tale continues to unfold, everyone is eager to see what the CC will do next and what the implications of that action will be for the entire cryptocurrency market. Everyone in the community was taken aback when they received the Wells notification that was delivered to Uniswap, which is the largest decentralized market in the entire planet. The actions that the SEC has taken against Uniswap have significant repercussions not only for the commercial enterprise, but for the entire ecosystem of decentralized banking as a whole. It is possible that the outcome of this court case will have an impact on the process by which authorities handle decentralized platforms and the cryptocurrency industry as a whole. Will the Securities and Exchange Commission be successful in its efforts to exert control over and prevent ventures such as Uniswap? Is it possible that it will fail once more, thereby demonstrating that the cryptocurrency field is grappling with legal uncertainty? These changes are having rippling impacts that are still being felt throughout the entire organization, which is one thing that is abundantly evident.
Whether whether cryptocurrencies will be regulated in the future is still a matter of debate. Regulatory poker is a highly important game, and the outcome of this game might have a significant impact on the entire cryptocurrency environment long into the future. The legal battle between Ripple and the SEC is still going strong, and things are getting ready for a dramatic conclusion that has the potential to transform the entire cryptocurrency business. There are speculations that something else is going on behind the scenes, despite the fact that there is a lot of drama in the courts and regulatory squabbling. Behind closed doors, large-scale agreements are gradually coming together, paving the path for Ripple's triumphant return to the spotlight later this year. It is our guarantee that you will not want to miss a single second of this riveting narrative from beginning to end. The process of making payments across international borders is in a constant state of flux, and Ripple has emerged as a revolutionary force that is causing a paradigm shift and garnering attention from unexpected sources. Ripple's implications in the Asia-Pacific area are discussed in a paper that was just recently made available by Bank of America. In the report, it is acknowledged that the company has the ability to totally transform the way in which we transfer money from one country to another. The research conducted by Bank of America and titled Breaking New Ground Harnessing Payments Innovation in APAC reveals that Ripple stands out as an exceptional case when it comes to blockchain-based international payments. In this particular domain, blockchain technology has not shown to be particularly effective up to this point. Nonetheless, Ripple stands out as a potential game changer. According to S. Venkat, who is in charge of Treasury Products APAC at Bank of America, application programming interfaces APIs are increasing the popularity of real-time payments by making it simpler for individuals to meet and conduct business with one another. Venkat discusses the transition to open banking, as well as the application programming interfaces APIs that are making it easier for the Treasury to make decisions and communicate information more swiftly. The responses provided by Ripple, on the other hand, give us hope for a future that is both more efficient and clear, despite the fact that payments that are both quick and cross-border are still the norm. Ripple has the potential to bring about change and open the door to new payment methods, according to Bank of America, which endorses this notion. A great deal of discussion has been taking place over the relationship that Ripple has with Bank of America, a number of rumors circulated regarding the nature and extent of the job that they were engaging in together. Julie Harris, who is the president of global banking at Bank of America, disclosed the relationship during an edition of the Treasury Insights podcast that was broadcast by the bank in April of 2020. Details, on the other hand, are still being kept under wraps. But Ripple was highlighted as a crucial partner in this endeavor by Harris, who stated that the bank was committed to providing individuals with cutting-edge solutions. Despite the fact that it is now engaged in continuous legal battles and is under careful scrutiny from authorities, Ripple remains steadfast in its commitment to its objective of revolutionizing the manner in which payments are processed all over the world. Bank of America's Chief Executive Officer Brad Garlinghouse, during his presentation at the Ripple Swell 2022 conference, stressed the potential for the company to gain a competitive advantage from Ripple's on-demand liquidity solution once legal challenges have been overcome. At the same time that the narrative of Ripple and its native digital asset XRP continues to unfold, significant shifts in the market have caused a great deal of anxiety among investors. Both fans and pros are concerned about the price of XRP because it has fluctuated a great deal over the past several months. On the other hand, there is a ray of hope of forecast that will go against all assumptions and rock the cryptocurrency industry to its very foundations. Trust us when we say that you won't want to miss what comes next. Ripple's own digital currency, XRP, is the subject of more interest and speculation than nearly any other asset in the volatile world of cryptocurrencies thanks to its unique characteristics.